Hey, this is Daniel for Radar Armor Pro. I'm here with the new Sony PXW180 camcorder. Now, I know a lot of videographers and photographers are moving over to DSLRs for their, for their, for their video needs, but there's some things that really a camcorder just does better. There's certain types of jobs where this is going to be the better tool for you. Um, first of all, just to have some of these features, it would cost you thousands of dollars to add on to your DSLR. They're already built into this in one single package. You can grab your camera and you're ready to go. Uh, one of those things is this amazing lens. This is a 25 times zoom lens. It's autofocus, it's a power zoom, and it starts out at about 26 millimeter equivalent to 35 millimeter. So if you do the math there, it goes out to over 600 millimeters. Also built into this camera are ND filters like many camcorders, but what makes this one kind of interesting is that it has this variable ND. You can actually program them in this because they're not uh, solid pieces of glass, it's done electronically. You can set them wherever you want as far as in the ND spectrum, or if you're out going around and you just have to make adjustments to the camera, this little wheel right here, you just dial it in and out, and you'll be able to adjust your ND in, in a much more subtle way. Also, like most camcorders, the X180 has two professional inputs on the side for XLR microphones. I have the optional Sony stereo microphone plugged in here on the side. Um, you've got all your audio controls on this. You don't have to carry a separate audio recorder, so if you're doing events, you're doing documentary, you're doing interviews, you've basically got in this box everything you need as far as the control of your equipment. So the X180 is equipped with Sony's MI shoe. The Intelligent Shoe pick up a lavalier microphone system. We're actually using it right now. But you put the lavalier receiver on top of the shoe. You don't need any XLR cables to plug in. It doesn't even require a battery. It gets battery from the camera. So if you're doing interviews, it's just a great tool to have. As far as image quality is concerned, this camera use, can use the same codec as the, the F5, which is the XAVC. It's over 100 megabits per second. So as far as storage options, this uses the professional uh, SBIS cards. It has two card slots. You can record simultaneously, you can record relay, you know, all the normal functions that you think of in this. You've also got an SD card slot here. You can record in uh, AVC HD as like a proxy, so uh, in, into that slot if you need to. So this camera has both HDMI, full size, and SDI out. And when you're working, you can either use the nice monitor over here if you want to put it up on your shoulder, or if you're in bright light, you've got an OLED eyepiece here. This camera is Wi-Fi compatible, so you can control it remotely with your phone. You can also FTP files uh, to a computer or whatever with it using the Wi-Fi locally, and live streaming will be something they're going to add in the future. So I want to thank Sony for dropping by with this camera today. It's a pre-production model, so we appreciate the few hours we get to play with it. It's going to be a great camera for journalists, ENG, wedding. Leave some comments below. We'd like to know what you think about it. And be sure to subscribe to Adam TV. I'll see you next time on Extra.